Searching in Command Prompt. There are some things that you can do that I actually find easier in the command line. And believe it or not, as powerful as Windows Search has become, searching is one of them. I'm gonna show you one example. We'll fire up the command line. I'm going to use the administrative version of command prompt here just because I want to be able to search all files. You can see that it will come up in our default directory of Windows System 32. If you do it without admin privileges, you'll show up in your user directory. In either case, type cd space backslash and hit enter. That'll put you at the root of your C drive. What we're doing is we're searching the entire C drive for some files. In my case, I'm going to search for star.pdf. That means any file that ends with a .pdf extension is what I'm looking for. And I'm going to add the slash s parameter to the dir command. The dir command is the directory listing command. It's what shows you what's in a folder in the command line. Slash s means search all subdirectories. So effectively what we're doing here is we are from the top of the drive, from the root of the drive, we are searching all folders for any .pdf files. Now it'll take a couple of seconds to actually run the search because it is scanning the entire drive, but as you can see, very slowly, it's going to start returning some of the results. And apparently on this machine, I have exactly one PDF file. The other thing that can be useful, especially if you have lots and lots of results, is to add the slash B uh, parameter. Slash B means return it in bare format. And what that means is rather than showing you a separate folder and the file and its size and all that kind of stuff, as you can see, all it's going to report is the bare full path to the file. Like I said, if you've got lots of search results coming out of this command, it's a convenient way to just get a list um, of the location of all the files that you can then save to a file, process, do other things with. But that searching in the command line, it can be very, very powerful. And at times I find it much more convenient than the GUI search built into Windows. Hope you find that useful. I'm Leo Notenboom. This is askleo.com.